Hi everyone, it's Happy Mail Queen again. So, um, I have another haul video, and um, just from a couple of stores, um, from Fabric.com and Tuesday Morning. So, let me just show you guys the stuff I got from Fabric.com. And um, I did show you one of the... Um, I believe I did show you one of the fabrics. And... Um, you guys saw this on one of my last videos. Um, I got the, this is called Moda Kiss Kiss Paris Love in Aqua. And I got this from fabric.com. I got a yard of it and it was, it was a little pricey, but I really, really wanted this fabric. It's $9.78 a yard. So I guess that's not so bad considering you're getting a full yard of it. Um... But yeah, I really, really wanted this for Valentine's Day. But, um, well, I just love it. It's Paris themed, so <laughs> you guys know I love Paris themed stuff. And and then um, I got some Tanya Whalen, and this one is called Sunshine. I don't know if I shared this with you guys. Maybe I did. I don't know. But here is it. Here it is again. In case I didn't. But there it is. It's Tanya Whalen Sunshine rose I'm assuming um, but I love it you get these cameos um, with um, beautiful roses on them and then the polka dots I love that and it's pink and um, I've wanted this for a long time so I finally went ahead and got it and I got a full yard of it and again that was the same price it was um, no this one was 948 a yard the Moda, the first one I showed you was nine seventy eight. So, um, of course, I really loved that pattern. Um, so I had to get a blue one, which is um, it looks it looks teal on the screen here, but I don't know if that's how it's coming out. But it's actually a um, sort of like a light blue color. But again, this is part of the Sunshine Rose, I think, collection. Um, from Tanya Whalen. So I love, love, love that. That's so pretty. So that's all I got from fabric.com. And then I was at Tuesday morning last week because my husband had a day off and he was kind enough to take me there so I can check out what they had. So I did get a few things. Um, and I don't think I shared it with you guys yet. No, I don't think so. Okay, so one of the things was, this was um, a cute little find. It's by Mark Richards Collections, and they're handmade stickers. And um, this one, obviously, is a Christmas one, but I like it because it's very shabby. And look at those teeny tiny silver pearls. I love it. So I thought that would be cute for um, just you know, a nice project for Christmas next year. Um, and I'm totally going to steal this idea. I'm going to try to make some little Christmas tree ornaments like that. So I was really um, happy to find this. And it was only 99 cents um, for, you get like four, four packs of different embellishments. So there's one. Here's um, a nice shabby um, tag, and then this one is a poinsettia, and again, it's shabby. It's not your red, um, you know, your usual red poinsettia. And then here is a more traditional one, but um, they're stockings. So I thought that was really cute, and for 99 cents, you know, why not? They had some other ones, but these, I was trying to be good, and I just grabbed one. And then I really love this um, eyelash trim from Martha Stewart. And I have this only in silver, but I thought I'd get the pink and silver um, one. And let's see if it has a... Let me see if that's actually what it's called. Yeah, I think that's... It doesn't have a color here, but obviously it's pink. Um, pink and silver. So... Love that for my shabby chic projects. Um, I fell in love with this little platter, and it's so cute for Easter. And look at that little bunny. 
Is that not the cutest thing ever? So they had several different, um, I think there was another design, another color, um, with a, a chick. I think it was a chick or a bird instead of a bunny, but I really like the bunny. So I thought this would look really cute in my craft room and I can just put some embellishments here, some blingy stuff. But um, there you go. When I do uh, curating for Easter, wouldn't that be cute? <laughs> so yeah, I just had to get it. And this one was, you know, I thought it was a little pricey. It was $6.99, but I, I couldn't help it. I had to get it. The bunny was just too cute. Um, and then I got this mug and I thought it was just so pretty it's very shabby and um, it has these pretty flowers and butterflies it's a double wall ceramic thermal travel mug and it's by Lennox and I thought this would be really cute because you know I sometimes like to bring my drinks here but I'm always afraid to spill it but it has this cover on it which is a little soft, but um, yeah, hopefully it does not spill, but it is ceramic, so it'll be nice and heavy. But yeah, for my craft room, when I'm crafting. And then I got these containers, um, which I thought was a really good deal. It was $1.99, and you do get two containers. And they're clear, and so I wanted to store some beads in here because... I have I have no room in my um, the current container that I'm using for my beads so this one has four compartments but I think the bottom one is just one big one which I thought it had compartments too but later on when I saw it, it yeah it wasn't so yeah I got a couple of these and then I checked out their paper section and I didn't get very much, um, but I thought this was really cute. It's Blossom Paper, um, and it's by Paper House. And I've never tried their papers before, so I thought, um, you know, I just flipped through it and I really liked it. So it's floral, floral print. And they're more like... How would I say it? It's more like a photograph of a, you know, like a, a real photograph. Some of them are anyway, like, see how clear the images are? So it's almost like a photograph. Um, and it's a good, good thickness. It's not too thick, but it's not thin either. So I just really loved the, the prints on these. So you get two of each. And what I really loved were these sentiments. That one says, sweet memories, you're truly the best, nothing be better than a true friend. So this would be really cute to do, um, f you know, uh, use for a swap. Good friends are forever, you are lovely. And I love this one. Friendship is a single soul dwelling in two bodies. So I thought that was cute. And just really pretty. Here's one with a hummingbird. And I really love hummingbirds too. We get a lot in our yard and I just love how their little wings just flap so fast and they're so tiny and they move so quickly. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just kind of fascinated by them. Um, but yeah, I thought that's what, that was cute. And here's a nice pretty tealish color with... Uh, vines on it. It has a vines design. Here's a nice pretty um, white rose print. And here's this pretty one with a green and rose color. And look how pretty that is. So I don't know. I thought it would be really cute for to, you know to make some cards because it is a six by six and here's some more sentiments you're so very special precious and few are friends like you live in the moment and follow your bliss 
so I really like those sentiments. Here's a pretty one with a carnation. Um, look at that. This is gorgeous. I don't know if you guys can see that very well. But, yeah. It's totally worth it because this was really cheap. It was. Let me show you. Look at that. A dollar ninety-nine. Yeah. Check out your Tuesday morning. And the borders, so you get a variety here. Pretty damask pattern in rows. Look at that. Beautiful. This is a green one here. And this pretty rose. And here's a nice blue floral pattern here and that's it so yeah couldn't pass that up and then I found this one and it's a chicken nitty crafts it's by chicken nitty crafts and it's called twirly girl and I just really like the pattern in this one too which I haven't even opened yet so but these are the patterns and I really love the florals here and it's very kitty. It has, let me see if I can flip there. Okay, so there's the florals right there. It has some striped green, some teacups. Oh, and they're double, double sided. Oh, I forgot to show you. So there's the side of that one. Um, I really like these little images too. I thought they were super cute. That's happy birthday. You see reverse side. Super cute, I thought. Okay, I'm already at 12 minutes, so I better hurry up. Um, but yeah, check it out. It is at Tuesday mornings. And look at that strawberry. Ballerina. It's really cute. Very girly. Hence the name. Um, but it was only $1.99, so I couldn't pass that up. Okay, and then the only other thing that I got from the paper section, I found this, <laughs> which is a Graphic 45 from the 12 Days of Christmas collection. Um, and the reason I got it is because uh, there's a lot of these paper flowers. I've never tried these before. I don't even know if I got this from their collection. Um, I have the 8x8 paper, but it was $4.99, but you get like six of these packs in there. So, I don't know. I haven't used, I haven't really used my 12, I mean my um, 12 Days of Christmas paper. So, I want to use it. So, I, I went ahead and got it because it coordinates with that. And then, I was leaving, ready to go to the cash register, and I found some dyes. Oh my gosh. So I had to get them, and so I got this Sizzix die here. There's the Sizzlet, and it's the, the bird on a wire. Birds on a wire, I should say. Isn't that cute? And then I got this one here, which is so super cute. And I didn't get to use it on Valentine's, but I love it. It comes with the tag and the love. And I, oh my gosh, look at that paper clip. So cute. And it's, a, this is the love set. There's three dies in there. And again, there's Sizzlet's dies. And then I, I found some more. These were a little bit more pricey, but they're the big extra long dies. Um, and look at this. It's a pop-up. Isn't that cute? Because I, I still feel bad about missing the Sizzix sale. <laughs> I can't say that enough. It's like, oh my gosh, why didn't I get anything? You know, and um, of course these aren't as cheap, but this is a pretty big die. It's the big one. And it is a 3D, you know, pop-up card. So um, this was $9.99. So I got it. And then 
I thought this one was really cool because it, it makes this hexagon box. It's another pop-up die. And this one is called the Ball 3D. And again, it's the ex you need an extended cutting pad. It's the big um, extra long dies. But isn't that cute? Can't wait to play with that. And then I got this one and I thought, oh my gosh, look at this. It's a cake. So it's a three tiered 3D cake. So I can't wait to play with that too. So that's all I got from Tuesday morning. So that is it. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.